so we already have calculated our operating profit and this is completely fine but i also need to teach you another way to calculate operating profit using dax and that is basically going to be our traditional way and that traditional way is gross profit minus all the operating expenses that is going to be operating profit right so let us do that in the dex that how do we do it but before that let me take a look at data again and let me show you what we are trying to achieve okay so if we can scroll down in the pnl you know that we already have the sum of the trading account and that has been defined as gross profit in the data we already have a measure that has been defined as gross profit if we simply take the operating account expenses, operating ex account total from uh, and we simply deduct that from the gross profit, we will be reaching at our operating profit. And this is what we are going to do now. So I repeat, we will take the gross profit and we will deduct the total of this operating account right from here to here. And that is going to be our operating profit. So let us do that in the DEX. And for that, I will say, please define a new measure and in this new measure give it a second place okay so here we start now so i'm going to name this as operating profit 2 2 just because we already have the operating profit so i will name it as operating profit 2 i will delete it later on and uh, this is going to be first of all let us simply refer to the previous calculation that we already have and that is going to be gross profit simply write gross profit and it will give you the measure this calculator icon on the left of gross profit is showing you that this is a measure and now we need to deduct right but rather than deducting i will use the plus sign and the reason is the expenses are already in negative so negative negative will become a positive so since these expenses are going to be already negative i'm using the plus sign it will automatically be handled right so now i am going to plus and what i'm going to plus i'm going to use the uh, i'm going to deduct the value that is going to be the operating account right so if i can scroll down i will say the class should be operating so i will say please calculate because we have to define a filter we have to apply the calculate function and i will say please calculate the ftp that is basically total ftp total for the period value and i'm gonna say uh, then apply the filter that is going to be on class so the class should be equals to operating account okay so once we have done that simply close the brackets and uh, here we go so everything is sorted let me explain again gross profit plus i mean minus i uh, calculate total ftp but only where the chart of account class value is operating account okay so let me format that to a whole number give it a second please okay so we only need to change the table here and that is going to be gl we have to be a bit you know slow here because system responds a little slow this is going to be very heavy program and uh, finally let us apply let us make it comma separated okay so it is done now so you can see operating profit 2 has been added here in my in my in my gl so i will go back to my dashboard and we are at the right place now you know in this visual there is no filter already because we were already using our uh, measure in this one so there is no filter so let me close that and now let me remove the previous calculation of operating profit because we already have these values to compare let me remove that and let me bring in the operating profit too and once we do that you can see that we have the same values for the calculation of operating profit now whatever whichever way is easier for you whichever you like is fine uh, i like the second style more but that is only my personal preference you can choose any of these done so we are done with operating profit so let us now talk about uh, other values as ibtida and pbit let us do that as well